With the leap range from Myra, shower enclosure installation is a breeze. In fact, it's never been easier. With pre-assembled, unhanded doors and panels and twist and lock, Myra's pioneering screw-free door installation system. They're easy to fit, great to use and stylish to look at. Every enclosure comes with tough and safety glass as standard and clean coat technology, a glass coating that makes it easy for your customers to maintain those sleek looks. And the whole range comes with a lifetime Myra guarantee for complete peace of mind. In this film, we'll show you just how easy it is to fit a sliding door enclosure in just a few quick steps. Before getting started, make sure you're up to speed with the installation notes and the shower tray is completely level and sealed to the wall. First of all, measure and mark 10 millimeters in front of the front edge of the tray. Get the wall jam in position and mark where the bottom fixing hole sits. Take the jam away, then use a 6mm masonry bit to drill into the wall and insert one of the supplied wall plugs. Put the wall jam back onto the wall and fit the bottom fixing screw. Using that bottom screw as a pivot, you'll be able to easily mark the other fixing points, making sure the wall jam stays plumb using a spirit level. Drill the rest of the fixing points where you've marked them and insert the wall plugs. Next, apply silicon sealant to the wall at the bottom where the jam will be placed and at the top of the tray. Finally, pop the wall jam into place, insert the screws and fully tighten, checking everything with a spirit level. Then do the same with the wall jam on the opposite side following the same steps, making sure it's upright using a spirit level. The next step is to insert the side panel into the wall jam. Make sure the panel pivots outward a bit so you've got enough room to slide the door into place. Put the sliding part of the glass door to one side. Then insert the pre-assembled door frame into the opposite wall jam and the door frame into the corner post. Take the 3mm Allen key that's supplied and use it to turn the three twist and lock mechanisms 90 degrees clockwise. This locks the door frame and the corner post together. Myra's unique twist and lock installation system removes the need for drilling and screwing through the door's profile and wall jam. It's quick, easy and hassle-free, and because the fixtures are hidden, you'll get a smooth finish. There are three pre-assembled twist and lock mechanisms on each door and side panel. With just a quarter of a turn of an Allen key, they're securely locked in place, minimum effort for maximum impact. Next, centralise the door frame and the side panel within the wall jams, making sure they both line up with the sides of the tray. Use a spirit level to check everything is plumb, then take the 3mm Allen key and turn the three twist and lock mechanisms, fixing the side panel and the wall jam together. Check the door alignment again, then lock the door panel into the wall jam with the 3mm Allen key. Use a good amount of neat washing up liquid to lubricate the rubber infill strip. Position it like this, then feed it down the length of the side panel profile and finish by trimming to its size. Do the same for the opposite door panel profile. Then insert the aluminium infill strips working from top to bottom and making sure they sit flush. Then fasten the magnetic infill strip into the corner post, ensuring that the magnets are on the inside of the door frame. Finally, fit the door seal to the fixed glass panel. The next job is to get the sliding door into position. Checking the handle holes are on the correct side. Find the Allen key bolt on the top rollers and turn it clockwise until the rollers are locked at their uppermost position. Refit the sliding door, making sure the top rollers have slotted into the top track. 
Then you'll need to press down on the quick release mechanisms on both lower roller assemblies and pop them into the bottom door track. Next, fit both seals to the sliding glass panel. When you do this, keep an eye on the magnetic seal at the closing end of the door, making sure it lines up with the magnetic infill strip that's in the corner post. Start with the inside door handle, popping it into place and fixing it by tightening the two screws. Then attach the outside handle and tighten the two grub screws. Almost done. Run some silicon along the outside surfaces of the door and side panels, creating a watertight seal. To finish, use a dab of silicon to fix the plastic top caps in place. Remember to let your customer know they'll need to wait 24 hours before using the shower, so everything has time to dry. And there you have it, the Myra Leap Sliding Enclosure. Simple to fit and guaranteed to create a real style statement in your customer's bathroom. <laughs>